Hey guys, here's my new Sony Ericsson X10 Mini with a silver battery cover, uh, like an Alienware. And um, I also have here is a pink battery cover. Well, so girly for me, right? Okay, so I will try to put the pink battery cover on this one and uh, okay uh, here as you can see uh, the back uh, of the Sony Ericsson X10 mini unlike the X10 mini pro doesn't have the battery okay so um, let's try it on it is quite easy. See? It's done. Well, as you can see, this one is very good looking. It is neat. And as you can see, it uh, is quite glossy. And uh, it feels very good when holding on your hand however I don't have the same solid feeling I have with my HTC Hero well I have to say that HTC has done a great job for this device otherwise there is nothing wrong with uh, the X10 Mini and actually I personally think that this is one of the nicest devices um, in the market today okay now so let's turn this on uh, as you can notice right away is the new lock screen in yes here you can uh, slide the button on the right to mute or unmute the phone uh, or slide the button on the left to unlock the phone and the second thing that you can notice is the new live wallpaper supported in Android 2.1 um, however remember that uh, there is no live wallpaper pre-installed um, but uh, there are many live wallpapers you can find on the Android market the widgets um, stay the same um, as you can uh, have only one widget per screen but you can have unlimited widgets and uh, you can rearrange or add widgets uh, very easily and I find there is no problem with that okay so now let's have a look at the timescape application this um, basically lists all of your Facebook and Twitter status and um, also your code log and even SMS in a very nice application and uh, the animation of the application is really great and I really love that uh, to bring the application launcher you just simply slide the screen up oh, I really love the animation of the four icons on the edges let's do that again see that is really interesting so now let's have a more detailed look on the application launcher and uh, this one is quite different uh, to the normal application launcher in other Android devices where you have to slide through pages uh, this is pretty much like the iPhone and uh, I have to say that I don't really like it uh, why don't we just have a normal application launcher like this and uh, I can find my application very easily
you can rearrange the position of the items and uh, uh, let me show you how to do this uh, for example this icon mm. okay um, firstly you long press on the icon and uh, well you can just click on the icon to uninstall this is a neat feature and I think it is uh, useful on the other hand rearranging the icons is not really useful because it is so slow and uh, uh, I don't uh, think I will do that right now because uh, it surely will mess up my layout okay that's it for now see you next part